Second time I've heard this in about a week time. It's about Jesus standing at the right hand of the Father, cheering Stephen on, who was, you know, just about to die a horrible death. And I, and I, and I you know, that really spoke to me. Um, and, and I really believe, you know, when you look at the life of Stephen, his life was a life that was unafraid. He was not afraid. He was not afraid to follow Jesus. He was not afraid to witness. He was not afraid to represent him, even if it cost him his life. And I believe the word that, that the Lord is saying to us today, the prophetic word the Lord is giving us to us today is unafraid. Are we going to live this new season which is starting about right now. Everybody's coming back from holiday. Are we, are we ready to live unafraid for Jesus? Not afraid if, if people are against us at work. Not afraid to witness of what he's done in our lives and that he truly is king over our lives. Unafraid to, to represent him, to, to show his love, to show his goodness in the world around us. Unafraid. And I believe the Lord is calling you and me to be unafraid. How many of you are with me on that? How many of you are with me on that? Come on, you can do better than that. 2022, 23 is going to be the year where Celebration Church, Hilversum and Huizen and Delft and Paris and everywhere where we are, we're going to live unafraid for King Jesus. We're going to live a life that, that, that captures God's attention that he's actually sitting on the throne and he's standing up because we live for him, because we, we are willing to even die for him, right? So that's 2022, 23, and we're gonna do this together. We're going to live 